Okay guys, so I've been using my 2018 CNC machine quite intensively to cut out the parts for my next CNC machine. Uh, but uh, I start to get sick of like every time I cut a piece I have to reset the um, position, especially in the Z axis because I have to set it to the surface of the stock and uh, I have been doing it like, with my eyes uh, it's kind of not really accurate sometimes it, uh, I set it correctly and it can cut through sometimes it doesn't so uh, I was googling around and found out just they actually have the function to do that more accurately so I just followed the guide and um, here's what I made for the two prop just uh, you only need two wire connected to kind of like alligator clips here uh, and uh, the other side you have the 2.54 connector so you can plug it directly to the back of the control board so let me just show you where to plug it so uh, here I have the uh, board is a woodpecker 3.2a gerbil so you can gonna to plug it to the pin A5. This one. It doesn't matter like which way you plug it. Uh, as long as uh, you plug it in, because uh, the way it works is that you going to create a closed circuit with the two clip. So it doesn't matter which side. So I just put it to the front. And uh, you also need a metal plate like this one. Uh, I have here the angle aluminum. The thickness is uh, 1.6 millimeter. Just I measured to, with my uh, caliper. So first of all, you just clip one clip to the two, and uh, the other one just to the uh, plate like this and you slide the plate underneath the tool and uh, on the control software here you will type in the console the G38.2 here and Z minus 12 just mean it will go down 12 millimeter in the Z axis F24 just mean uh, it's going to go at the rate of 24 millimeter per minute so I just hit send so it just press firmly on this board and it moved down very slowly and uh, as you can see just it just stopped when the tip of the tool touched the plate so it's kind of working now so uh, next step is just I have to type in the command here G92 and uh, you set Z at uh, 1.6 millimeter uh, just the uh, thickness of the plate that you use so just press enter and now I will move it up Okay, I move the tool up here and then I take this out. Okay, now I'm going to move the tip of the tool to Z0 with the command here. G1 Z0 at the speed like F24. So enter. There we go. It just stopped right on top of the surface of the stock. So now it's really working. So uh, I can use this function like to kind of like not only set up the stock every time and also you can do like tool change 
Uh, every time you do some more complicated engraving like 2.5D pictures of something uh, and you need like more details you cannot really use only one type of tool you will have to change out the tool and uh, you will use this um, kind of setup to uh, prop the tip of the tool uh, how high or where the tip of the tool is and uh, you can just um, and do a lot more beautiful stuff.